komme tilbage. Tak skal du have. Og okay, det igen. Okay, igen. Jo tak, du var i hvert fald også sidste her. Hej. Hej Christoffer. Vil du ikke indkalde til et møde i K-udvalget? Øh, meget gerne i eftermiddag, hvis du vil lade sig gøre. Selvfølgelig. Velkommen tilbage, Birgit. Tak, Sanne. Kontakter du vores partisekretær til at møde? Ja, selvfølgelig. Tak. So, let's talk a little bit first about yeah. Norman and of Borgen. Do I say that right? Borgen. Borgen. Og vi er op. Borgen. 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 Ja. Borgen. Mm, Borgen. <laughs> You're yeah. not particularly fond of your own language. Well, I am. No, I am. Uh, of okay. course I am. I mean, of course, it's, 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 no, it's not a beautiful language, but it's my language. I love it. Yeah. And I love the people who speak it well, you know. Um, I think I've made a sarcastic, uh, t you know, I mentioned it. And then I just read in Danish papers, oh, she, you know, piss in her nest and I don't know what. So I'm being very careful now. It's beautiful. Yeah, you, you, you said that when you try to seduce somebody in Danish, it sounds like you're throwing up on that. Uh, that's what you said, right? That's what I said. <laughs> you know, I tried to be charming. Um, I never should try to be charming. No, I, it's, it, yeah. And, and um, I mean, Danes didn't take that well. Really? So I would not repeat that. Okay. Um, but it's, I mean, it's very... Um, i think it's very different to hear your own language uh, mm -hmm. and to, to understand the music. We've always been envious of the Swedes mm -hmm. because uh, I, I was growing up with just Danish and Swedish television and in Danish, and then in Swedish you go, and when they said, you know, what, what's on telly tonight, it really sounded exciting, no matter what they said. And I thought, wow, I'm going to see that. What, what we see of Danish television is the killing and, and your fabulous mm. series. So I get the impression that Danish public TV, because it's produced by Danish public TV, is doing a fantastic job and that Danish TV is the best in the world. Am I right about this? I don't know. I'm the worst person to ask. I don't. I you hardly don't watch, watch any uh, TV in Denmark and I've never seen any Belgium TV at all. <laughs> and why would you want to? <laughs> no, I saw, actually, I saw some in, um, in, uh, at the Emmys. There was uh, something very funny coming from Belgium. Maybe that's what if the the, the yes. jokey thing. Yeah, yeah, that was funny. That is very good. Actually. Yeah, that was yes. really good. Yeah, I didn't. I, I thought they that you should have won. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And then you did win. No, 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 no. Okay. A French thing oh. that I didn't find funny. About, yeah. <laughs> uh, let's talk about uh, the enormous success of 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 Bohem. Mm, yes, um, because, well, you look um, depressed when you say it, but it's okay, <laughs> Bon. Yeah. Well, how has that changed your life? Does, does it parallel the life of Bigger than Newburgh? That all of a sudden, so many people are interested also in you and your life and you as a celebrity, kind of. Well, as you say, I travel around outside Denmark a little bit now, and uh, th that's certainly a change. More than that, it's what, what has really changed. I've never been involved with something like that. I've just, I've just lived in Borgen for three and a half years and, and now I'm out. So that's, that's a life changer, you know, to just do the same work for, for such a long time. And, um, and you're out forever? There's not going to be a fourth series? No. No, 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 no. That's also that's a difference it. with American shows, right? Because yes. they keep on going yes. if it's successful. Exactly. But you know when to stop. Yes. Yes, <laughs> we do. <laughs> Og derfor vil jeg nu lade det være op til den danske befolkning at træffe deres valg. Ikke om hvilket køn deres statsminister skal have, men om hvem de mener er den bedste statsminister for Danmark. Hermed udskriver jeg folketingsvalg i Danmark til afholdelse tirsdag den 11. juni.